en el capítulo anterior. No, me voy a... <risa> Ahora seguimos. Sweet. This rope is perfect for the swing. Hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. Oh, yes. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? I'm sorry, that was rude of me. Well, don't you worry about it, Lee. We've got a great big dining room that will fit your whole group. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. Mm -hmm. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Cara de loca, Betty. Ahora sí. All right. This shouldn't be too tough. I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were Aww. kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. <laughs> Siempre nos haces felices, Lee. Siempre me haces feliz. <laughs> Se ponía muy sentimental. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right. Keep me posted. <laughs> Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Hmm. Oh. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? Just trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Sounds good. No quiere que vaya granero. What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. <laughs> Hi. Howdy. <laughs> An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman, he figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. Well. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and... We gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. You're like us. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. 
You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. <laughs> it wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I... I'm, I'm sorry, alright? We'll work it out somehow. Well... Hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. Mmm, qué rico. There's one. Qué rico. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. <laughs> Come on, let's push it off. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Sure, there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Hmm. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. Okay. That's all. Thanks. That's it. There's another one. I see it. Mmm. Carne cocida o asada. No. Las manitos. <laughs> Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. <laughs> you never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Christ, I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Just try to focus on the task. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. Mr. Crispy! I think Crispy. we get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> if you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on! Calm down. Little help here, Lee? Calm down. I'm on it. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on! Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here! Uh, 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 what the? Get to the gate! Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea! Fuck! Now what? With the fence on that gate, it's our only way out! We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! You assholes! Wait. 
que salir de acá. Lee, hurry up. Cálmate. No fuel. Of course. Hay que mover esto. Vamos. ¿Qué? Ah. Oh, rayos. We can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit, the house. Pasito, pasito. Calmense. What happened? Shit! It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move him. Ni siquiera es el mismo. Yo no debía haber perdido la cabeza ya de un tiro. Oh, no es? Damn ambush out there! Holy shit! Are, are you okay? A bandits here on our property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama? Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hey y'all! Mark! Oh my God! What happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just. Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down. But I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. <laughs> Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, kids, look what Lee got working for you. A swing. I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Thanks, Lee. 
You're the best. Yeah. Hmm. No wonder you're the leader of your group. Oh. ¿Qué fue eso? Se teletransportaban. ¿Qué? Oh. Lo pegaba allí. Hey, Haley, found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure, in case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods, seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. I guess. Uh... Lily isn't too thrilled about being here? I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. You're with me on this, right? <sighs> huh. Always the diplomat. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Mm. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Thanks for fixing it. Oh. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Gee. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. No me pongan esa música. I'm gonna cry. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Aww. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. They're storing gasoline all over the property. <laughs> Perdón si estoy muy callada, es que... Me concentro mucho. Y estas personas hablan mucho y estas personas que digo y nada. Me me invado por el juego. Lots of hay. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Mm -hmm. Para la vaquita. La vaca hace mu. La vaca hace mu. Acá está la vaca. <laughs> no mentira. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. 
I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? I, we don't... We... How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hmm. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Shut up. <laughs> Esa cara fue como diciendo, cállale, calla. Tengo razón, soy la líder. Ah, la, 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 la. Ah, para. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mm-hmm. Uh... Eso es agua. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. No, boys. No. If there's Sorry. not... No, que por eso. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You no saw what shit. they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Por qué dice lista? Soy hombre. Soy Lee. Okay, sí. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Take care, sweet pea. Wish me luck. 